All right, so I want to finish this cup off. I know it's had it sitting here for a while. And so the first thing before it goes back on the turner to add a decal it is it's had its first layer of epoxy along with the glitter and it just needs its decals and then the, the final layer of epoxy. So first things first is it needs a good sanding to smooth it all out and then it goes over the turner for the decals and epoxy. So we're using 220 grit sandpaper just going all over it and as you can see it was relatively simple and it's just going to go over to the turner at this point doesn't take very long to sand it down short time later get it set get everything set up on the Cricut machine I didn't show the printing process uh, the first few decals are print and cut I printed them off on a inkjet printer on printable vinyl load, load it up now it's cutting it for me unloading putting the next set in cutting it up got one more set and now I'm pulling them all apart getting all the tiny little pieces and then got to put some uh, transfer tape in there, cutting them all apart. And now the, the saying that I'm putting on the cup, this one was being a little bit of a problem, getting the backer plate on there. As you can see, a couple of the words stuck to it, so I had to pull them off, set them to the side. But that's all right. Uh, I've learned how to uh, move them off to back into place. And as you can see there, I was able to move them very easily back into place and then just remove all the inner parts to the letters. Just picking them all out individually between all three of them. This whole process took about uh, 45 minutes between all three of them so just going being very careful not to remove any of the little pieces and then apply transfer tape to that one and then here's my top outline doing a skulls motif this is going to go along the top edge of the cup this is where it gets a lot of not tricky because there's a lot of tiny little pieces that have to come out. I've also got my tweezers there and those because those tend to stick in there especially with those tiny little cuts the blade doesn't always get the tiny cuts completely and then one of the skulls tried pulling up there and I had to reset it and then applying some transfer tape and now we've got everything got the cup on the turner here got to get it all wiped down with some alcohol so that everything sticks properly now it's all dried off just trying to get the decals pulled off of the back and we get it lined up hand rotating it and pulling the transfer tape off making sure everything's smoothened off so that the epoxy can lay completely flat next is the statement and it goes on make sure you don't get all the way to the edge so you have something to pull on 
sometimes the letters try to come off when you pull the transfer tape up and then I'm putting one of my the mask on the bottom underneath the sing and then rotate around and then start putting the faces on and those are just being random along the back side of the cup get them all on and then I've created a monogram that I'm sticking on the bottom of each one of my cups now they're all on and it's time to throw some epoxy on so let's get the epoxy going I've got a cup in the background waiting for epoxy and glitter but starting at the top and then doing the bottom always smoothing out then doing the bottom the very bottom and then smoothing it all out always top to bottom working from the middle down to the bottom and there it's got its first layer as always thanks for watching like and follow for more videos